my husband is an endocrinologist and he was looking for a fellowship that had pituitary programs and I was looking for a fellowship that had transplant programs and this was one of our top several choices and we came down here and fell in love with Augusta and so this was our ma we matched here actually is a couples match for our fellowships Tony and endocrine and me and nephrology and we've been here ever since and that may be what's causing the, the tenderness there. We'll send you downstairs to get an ultrasound, okay? I have to have continuity of care, and that's the one thing about the nephrology practice that I enjoy, is I can take them from having chronic disease to transplantation and take care of them over the whole spectrum of their, of their life. If I couldn't follow patients continuously, I wouldn't be in this business. We'll get you fixed up. Thank you. All right, take care, guys. What I would like to convey, or hope to convey to medical students is, um, you gotta love what you do. And when you get up in the morning, if you don't like what you do, you gotta get out. And the greatest joy is taking someone who's really got a talent for complex disease and getting them steered in the right direction to pursue training in, in an area that, that I think they would be good at. I'm involved in more clinical research, different combinations of medicines and hypertension, and also different immunosuppressive therapies or combinations of them in transplant patients. And so that's what a lot of the research we've done at MCG is looking at different protocols in transplantation and trying to pick the best protocol for the best patients. I'm looking, perhaps in the future, to get a master's in healthcare administration. That would certainly give me another edge uh, administratively uh, to get involved more in hospital-related healthcare activities and physicians. The other thing that um, I'm real excited about is that I'm a personal trainer. I got certified this last year. And so one of the advantages of a physician that's a trainer is that I could work with people with chronic disease. And so that's going to be actually my t retirement job is to have a, a fitness um, program for people with chronic disease in the CSRA.